So welcome back and today we're going to be taking a look at Origins ship, the CDF Roma. Did I just get that wrong? What's it called? Talk to me bro. Um, this is a CDP Roma. CDP, that, I got the initial wrong. So it's the CDP Roma and I'm just going to tell Correct. you, I've got to tell you the exterior styling. I'm loving the black. You've got lots of different uh, patterns going on around the ship, which can help to break yeah. up the line and give it a much more organic, plated feel. It's funny how you say organic and plated, but you know, it's just like not noise, but not just simple planes. You know, you've, you've managed to break it up. Really. Yeah, it's kind of nice. You've got like plates, but you've got and ribbing, but it's you, you know you haven't used the same thing throughout the whole ship, which is kind of fresh. So. That's my opinion on that. I like the crystal on your AMC at the front. It does look really mean. That, that uh, shotgun array at the front looks real nice. That's really yeah. nice, in fact. So kudos on you for that. Um, I like the yeah. use of the yellow lighting in your rocket bays. That's a really clever thought. I never thought to do that, and I like that a lot with the wedge. Very clever. Got some spiky bits, which spiky bits are always fun. I especially like the struts, in fact, that you've got coming down with uh, the power. There's like a wing coming down. I don't know if you can see where my surfboard is, but that, that particular arm I'm looking at there looks real nice. Um, and yeah, definitely underneath you've got... Is this, is this a turret? Um, it is. Yeah, it is a turret, yeah. It's a really interesting design of turret you've got there. Yeah. It's really interesting because of the way it's held together. It's kind of like a U or a C or a, like a G clamp. But I don't know. It's kind of cool. Um, liking the view of it from underneath. Like I say again, the choice of uh, wedging is actually really clean, but not so clean that it looks out of place. Not saying something because that's it's difficult you know, to get it right. And also the lava, your use of lava deserves extra credit because you've managed to make it look like you've got some kind of uh, systems, some kind of, I don't know, coolant, fuel line, whatever you want to call it, power conduit, it looks nice. Yeah. So yeah. Is there anything you wanted to show me in particular? Um, it's been a while since I've looked at this. I've had it been collecting dust, but um, if I remember correctly, there is a bit of an interior, not much. Okay, well let's take a look. Should we go to the back at the hangar bay? Because I can see that door's open. Yeah. Is that a sensible place to start? Um, yeah. Okay. And. You, are you already here, or did I beat you here? Um, you beat me here. Just meet me there. I'm derping out, forgetting where. You know, I'm gonna jump into a core, see if I can find it. Just taking a look at the shuttle in your shuttle bay. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, you're getting so used to it, you're just jumping the gun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm already here. I'm already here. I'm reviewing. I'm reviewing this shit. I'm waiting for the pilot. You can do about it. it is a nice looking shuttle. <laughs> it is a nice looking shuttle. It's really quite simple. Reminds me of a submarine. Reminds me of a DS9 runabout. Yeah. Is it a yellow submarine? No. No, it's black. Oh, hello, Ethio. Yeah. So, where are we going? We're heading in deep. Yeah. And then we're gonna get high and reach the top of the spaceship. That sounds wrong. What? <laughs> and meet Lucy and Submarine reference. Look, my mannerisms are my mannerisms. <laughs> yeah, they're what makes you you. Getting Tom. high in yeah. the Except for when he's off the mic. I'm off the mushrooms. I mean. <laughs> 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 Now then, tell yep. me all about it, bro. Well, back here you got, similar to like in the old bombers, you got a sort of a tail area where you can see out of. Yep, this is a really nice observation area, I like it. Yeah. 
And then through here, you get the whole error thing. Engines, yeah. I like exposed engines. engines. Yeah, yeah. Obs yeah observations up here. Do you know what? This is actually clean enough to have like a little laser battle in here, you know? Because we've made like yeah. proper little areas with cover and stuff up here. Yeah. yeah it's really cool. Yeah. Probably use this point almost like an ambush area. Yeah, you could have security out there. Ain't nobody getting through. Nice. So, just crouch, they're going to hack into the thruster system and just pop them. Yeah, it reminds me of like a Halo 2 level, in fact. Like big yeah, time. Yeah, I can see that. <coughs> All these little stairwells with like proper we cover everywhere. Bombs. Yeah, I think we did, but it's okay. Right. I'm in control. I'm walking about. Look, yeah, definitely, man. Halo 2. All up in here. It's really nice. Whatever your inspiration was. In fact, did you have any inspiration when you were making this interior? Because it is very much a break from what we usually see. I'm seeing like, you know, inset flooring with the with these little areas here for the seat, that's kind of cool. Got a nice yeah. original, like, is that the ch captain's chair? Yeah? Um, yeah. Yeah, captain's chair. Captain or respective leader. It's kind of cool. Then we've got more computer systems. Oh, wow, and each has got different systems. Very nice. Oh, wow, it's like a proper, yeah, yeah, I'm really liking this. It's very authentic and, uh, Sort of useful, useful, usable. Great for role playing if you've got lots of people. Yeah. You know, it's, this is the Just sort of thing I'd up. be a nice set. You know what I mean? It makes a nice set. Yeah. Uh, fair play, mate. This is a very, very nice bridge. You put a lot of effort yeah. into it, and it's very, you know, you've got to, it's, it's in keeping as well. It's not just random. So, um, yeah, fair play. I really like this. This is really good. And right. Tucked right in the, uh, underneath the bridge, you got the core room. Underneath the bridge, right? How do I yeah. get? How do you get that? Oh, haha! -ha. So much Halo inspiration. Look, please tell me where you got the ideas for this, because it just reminds me of Halo 2. Don't know why. Mm, to be honest, I don't know where. I, sometimes it just pops in my head. I'm like, you know, that actually sounds like a really good idea. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's just imprinted into the back of his mind. Well, whatever, whatever the inspiration was, mate, you've got some really clean ideas, and this sort of staircase design coming up around here, you've broken the room up without making it too noisy, which is, like, yeah. the hardest thing. And it all fits together real nice. I'm loving this stair. It's funny. I'm going, yeah, what a staircase! And he's, and he's like, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. It's blowing your mind. He's like, dude, I do this, like, on every ship. Yeah, yeah. Like, why is he getting so hyped yeah. about? This is like the least impressive part. <laughs> okay, where are we going next? Next thing you know, he's going to be like, oh man, look at this panel. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this discussion table. Mahogany. Uh, <laughs> oh, mahogany. <laughs> That's Bro, amazing. Real mahogany. Yeah. And can I be in a placed gravity unit? Oh good, because I was a little little bit skew if there for a minute. Oh wow. Oh. <laughs> oh, where the trees breathe you make it fire. Out of references, Team Four Star comes out of the woodwork. Yeah. <laughs> then up here you have a sort of a forward viewing area. Well yeah, the yeah. good era of Team Four Star. I am trying to do Navi's voice. <laughs> I don't know where I, I just... can barely do Quillet. Moving on. on. You know, so. that really looks like the viewer, the gunner of the ship sits like with big massive cannons like right to the left and right of the window. Yeah. Yeah. It's Ooh. nice. Visual glitches. Origin's head is sticking out through the upper part of the hole. Yeah, I don't know sure. where he went. He just disappeared. I'm sort of backtracking to see watching. if I missed anything. He's I got. With his own ship. I oh, got. No, that's why. Oh right, I got a medical bay, and I've got another little cafe. <laughs> cafe room looks like a like a little little kitchen. Don't know. Yeah. But yeah, I think we it's saw the whole thing. ship though, didn't we? I think um, we managed yeah. to get around it, and then see we survived long enough 
See, look, this is great. It's like, oh, I can get around here. Pew, 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 get in the cover. Pew, pew. This is a great little level. Yeah. You, you, you've they designed an FPS. Like a crouching mechanic into Star Maze. I thought we were going to get one of those. Do you need help, Origin? Probably will um, be in with one of the next updates. Maybe. But yeah, so... He's Origin. He always needs help. Right. <laughs> Do you reckon I can make this jump? I could huh? Oh, no. He didn't... Oh. I didn't even jump. Don't worry, Tom. It's okay. okay. That was the last we didn't heard hit of the ground. Video. There's no ground. Hey, Tommy, no. Right into the ship, top side of the, uh, the hull. <laughs> I'm coming. If that were real space, he'd be fucked. I'm here. <laughs> right, so what, what, where? See my core. He's right up here. here. Oh, I went around the wrong way. What? Where is he? I don't see him. I oh, see wow, him. now I see him. So, yeah, uh, what's your name then, mate? Origin. Your name's Origin, so uh, yeah. And what's the name of the ship again, mate? The CDP Roma Heavy. Okay, well thanks for you taking just... the time to join me on the lineup review, and I uh, can't wait to see your next ship. So thanks to everybody you else watching. A... And he, just, uh, had a massive he did have a massive transporter accident. So thanks to everybody watching. Uh, we're going to be getting onto the next ship in the lineup review now, so uh, thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.